I got all my special tools ready. There is a premiere. I don't think I've ever done this um, Fratelli Carli store haul. Um, I've done it on my other channel. And there is this guy who was so hungry for for his mom's bread. He couldn't wait until I cut it. How is the bread like? Do you like it? Mm -hmm. This is a microphone also. Yes. Um, I was trying just to get some uh, chocolate spread, like Nutella replacement, which is much healthier according to the ingredients. It's not made with lard, an enormous amount of lard, uh, like Nutella. It's made with olive oil and the rest of the ingredients is good too. So I thought since I'm buying chocolate spread, let's go ahead and buy something. Um, even better than chocolate spread. Let me show you. Hey, why not so, so big? It's huge because it's. I got you some chocolate spread. <laughs> These days, chocolate spreads are enormously uh, big. Yeah. Okay, let me. Let's start from chocolate spread. So I got four of them. If I buy, I buy four because. Uh, they can go uh, through four jars within three days if Wait, I don't hide them. That, Sometimes that, I simply hide. Hi, Janice. Is that the Nutella? Yes. Oh my gosh, yeah. oh. They call it Nutella because apparently it associates with chocolate spread. That's the only name they would prefer. We used to buy a lot of Nutella. I, I regret it so much these days. Yeah, this is, and this is not sponsored. I paid my own hard work money. <laughs> yes, it's really delicious. It's worth to mm -hmm. try. Mm -hmm. What is jiggly? It's jiggly because you need when the oil part is a bit uh, not very well mixed. So we'll mix it, and Mr. Beck will try it for us. We like it. Oh, I should have baked some sandwich bread. I, I made the regular uh, this kind. But it's okay. I think bread is bread. Although my children are very specific. If it's not with sandwich bread, uh, I may have some complaints from customers. Okay, let me mix it and show you the consistency. It's a bit, I think, as far as I remember, I haven't purchased Nutella for ages. It's a bit uh, more liquidy than Nutella. And don't ask me about the ingredients. There are very good ingredients. <laughs> as far as I know, it's... Hold on, let me first find the ingredients and then try to read it. Okay, hazelnut, 30% sugar, olive oil, skimmed milk powder, um, brown sugar, cocoa powder, uh, and a few other things. Okay, you need, you need to stir it very, very well. Mm, look, it's so perfect and so delicious. Mm. Yeah? I haven't tried it yet. You haven't tried it yet? You, you just didn't try it for a while. I haven't purchased it for a while. Let's see. Let's pretend we have never tried this chocolate spread. Arka chocolate spread unang tagas. I love this stuff. Come. Let's see, we need your opinion, Mr. Arka. He doesn't want to <laughs> mess his fingers. Uh, you want to do it yourself, Arka? Mm. Really good. It's really good, huh? Arka, Mr. Beck, you want to try some? I like a little bit. Look, Are you ready? he just dipped his. <laughs> <laughs> We're one family, yeah. one germs, one bacteria. It's perfect. It's perfect? Mm -hmm. If you say it's perfect, it means it's super perfect. 
Mm, this is the spread. Four jars. And the jars are so nice looking. I always recycle them. I mean, I even recycle bad looking I jars. I need more. You need more? I... Oh, such a nice packaging. <laughs> they also sent you um, a harmonica. Oh, this is really good. Mackerel filet. So delicious. It's like so tender. Um, is it in olive oil? Yes. Well, uh, one of my subscribers from my Russian channel, um, after seeing my enormous and um, profound love for olive oil, she just, uh, just uh, advised me to buy this company's olive oil just to give it a try. And since I was shopping, I thought I might as well get some other stuff just to try. And we loved everything. They are a bit pricey, to be honest. A jar of Nutella is $14.95, if I'm not mistaken, or $14.85, something like that. Okay, I may not be able to open this. I can open it. Oh, okay. Let me try. Okay, hold on. I'll, I'll give it a try. You need your confidence. Wow, Vodka. I can already do it on this. Mm, not that one. Let's leave this one, it's okay. Oh, no, it's okay. But you're still really strong. I love you so much. Okay, let's taste it. I can cook this with a lily. Oh no. He usually doesn't eat much when he goes to hockey. Because they say you, I mean, they don't say it's like that. You can't uh, skate with a full stomach. You'll have nausea. We like everything and anything with bread. Big this. An hour ago, it's still warm. One thing we can never do is wait until the bread is fully um, calmed down, cooled. Okay, this is such a big slice. Mm -hmm. Look how fine it looks. And I love this kind of um, marinated or um, I don't know how do you canned, huh? canned fish with um, marinated pickles, with pickles. So delicious. Try it, you will love it. Okay, ready, steady, go. Delicious. And you need to wipe your face. After this one, he says he's full. Okay, let's see what we have. I did purchase something new, but I don't remember what was it. We'll find out. And also, of course, I got my olive oil, as per usual. Although, I personally prefer buying olive oil from Ohai. They have this Ohai olive oil company. I've been there. Yeah, you've been there. Been. You've been there. Where? Olive oil company in Ohai. Remember? Oh, this. Well, what was, how is it called? At Jochanaka. Remember the sis, not the sisa. How is it called? In English? Swings, huh? Okay. Oh, you guys are listening what I'm talking about? They have this beautiful, like from childhood, swings by this uh, place. Mm. Pesto, probably. I of this should be new. Oh, I haven't tried this tapenade. This pesto. No, tomato spread, sun-dried tomato spread. Oh, these are the new stuff I never tried. Tapenade, the 
spread and what was this one? Artichoke spread. Oh, these are new products that we haven't tried. Okay, wait. He went through the garage door. All right, let's see. Artichoke is my love. Have you seen how I made artichoke in wood fire oven? Although you don't have to have a, a wood fire oven in order to make that artichoke, but it was amazing. Not sure how does this one taste, but I'm sure the one I made has no um, competition. Okay, let me mix it because it has some oil on top. Mm -hmm. It's pretty smooth. Don't ask me about ingredients. It's in very tiny. You can barely see anything. Hold on, let me see. I don't even see ingredient list. Or maybe there is. No one knows. It's a secret. Ingredients are pure secret. You wanna read it? Ingredients? Can you find them? I didn't see ingredients. No. no. Okay, probably they keep it a secret. Who knows this company? This is really good. So, so, so someone doesn't copy the ingredients when they make it. Okay. Artichoke spread. Mm -hmm. Of course. <laughs> You're so smart, I love you. And do you want to kind of wipe your face? So no one knows you ate almost half a jar of Nutella? I can do that. Chocolate, yeah, you can do that. That's another way of wiping. It's a cat way of wiping and that's a back way of wiping. <coughs> and on yourself, the way I teach you. I do like this. <laughs> well, you know, that's a very good cream, the moisturizer from um, hazelnut moisturizer. It has a good amount of olive oil and it can soften your cracked skin. This is really good. Lid. Lid. I'm gonna ask you to try. Oh my god, this is so good. I really don't wanna try it. For some reason, he never tried artichoke, my husband. But he doesn't even want to give it a try to figure out does he like that thing or no. I think he doesn't like the smell, huh? It reminds him... Smell it. Smell it, huh? It reminds him of... I don't want to say it. You want to try? Oh, so delicious. Teeny piece. See? It's all about convincing. Just a little bit. It's so delicious. And it has all the secret ingredients, you may think. I'm convincing him that it's very delicious. Say it, it's so delicious. It's delicious. It's okay. It's, okay. it's delicious. And this is Taponade. You may like this one. He's a mm, olive fanatic. I mean, I love olives too. Who doesn't like olives? Oh, there are people who are olive haters, I know. If there is one in my people, followers, please, don't be shy. We will understand you. We will kind of calm you down. <laughs> okay, let's see. There's taponade, how it tastes. So salty it's good but i didn't very mm, i didn't enjoy the texture it's so i don't know you feel that grainy kind of texture i don't know, you like it and it's super salty mm. no i made taponade it was amazingly delicious comparing to the one i made and i didn't even add too much spices or anything i guess olives were good Look who's coming. But squish. Oh. Mm -hmm. 
We have two kittens now. I don't know, probably if you follow my daughter's uh, channel, Life of Lilith, I'll, I'll link it in the description. She has the whole story, her mm -hmm. journey. After he's done eating, I just want to carry him. Okay, after he's done eating, he wants to carry him. This is Ishan, our boy. He needs some food. Can you go grab his food from outside? Okay. In the bag. Go. Okay. Ishan is like a prince. We named him because he's kind of, I don't know, he, he's born with his tuxedo. Such an elegant and such a nice kitten. We have two of them. Hajan? Yeah, that one. Mm -hmm. Bring it. Bring it. Oh, we will feed him. This smells so bad. This smells so bad. Of course, it's cat food. No, it's cat food smells so bad. We need to waste this for him. Yeah. Okay, let's add some water over. Hold on, hold on. Spicy, spicy, serious. So handsome, so beautiful. He has more colors than our other cat, Gisher. Gisher, which means night, the girl. Uh, she's completely black. You may not see her <laughs> anywhere. He's sleeping. <laughs> yeah, she's sleeping. I love you. After he's done eating, you can hold him. Yeah, I hold him like a baby. Yeah, he holds him like a baby. We tell him, you can hold him like a baby. Cats don't like being like a being held like a baby or being smart like me or being smart like him cats are actually very smart but not like back smart they're just regular smart they don't know what's one plus one they don't know what's one plus one one plus one is what two see did you hear that one plus one is what it's what two two hmm. ask the cat one plus one is two. Ash Ishan, what is one plus one? Cats don't care. Yeah, because they can't talk. <laughs> Maybe for that reason. Or possibly meowing means probably two. <laughs> if you meow two times, it means they know. This dog, have this dog. Okay, we'll let the cat do its thing. So the tapenade wasn't as I expected. My hands are wet now. Of course they are. Why? Oh, of course they are. Is it all or something? <laughs> no, I just washed them. Okay. Let's try sun-dried tomato spread. I'm sure it should be delicious. I have a feeling it's like the best thing ever. Did we buy sun-dried tomatoes from? I don't think so. No, we haven't tried. We got like pesto spread, but not the this kind. Mmm. That tastes like. It tastes good, like sun-dried tomato in a spread form. You wanna try? I don't know. Huh? I don't know. He, he really doesn't care. Lee. I really don't get it. Hi, Iris. And can you help Banta? She's gonna like the artichoke. And I have a feeling if I mix artichoke and tapenade, because the artichoke wasn't as um, salty um, and more finer. Artichoke, tapenade. Mm -hmm. So delicious, such a good combination. Mm. And also artichoke with this should be amazing. Mm. Imagine I that with all the flavors. You want me like to with try the artichoke, it? the olive spread, some dried tomato spread, and hazelnut and cocoa spread. Not the hazelnut. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Actually, not hazelnut, but I'm gonna try it the way you said it. Artichoke, tomato, and tapenade. Let's let's see. Let's see what Mr. Beck thinks. Hmm. Do I have a 
it's actually very delicious such a rich no, no, rich flavor so delicious you want to try artichoke spread it's so good no no why not the only spread my kids prefer especially our kind bit not this one she prefers everything and anything she's like in perfection you need to try artichoke Mm -hmm. Tapenade and this thing, and also try them all together. It's amazing in Konhamova. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Let's see what Miss Lily thinks. Mm -hmm. That's a good one. It's delicious, not just good. Mm -hmm. I like that one. It's isn't it salty? Mm-hmm. I like salty. She likes salty. And you will like love this too thing. salty. It's too salty. To me it was too salty and I mixed all three together so deliciously. You eat more bread than spread. I'm trying to split the bread. Mm-hmm. That's a good one. Is it just tomatoes? Sun dried tomatoes. Mm -hmm. Oh look who's coming. Where is his jar? Her jar, I mean. Ooh, it's outside. It's outside. Oh, shit. And this is the combination. Mm. It's, good. it's good. And this is delicious. It makes this less salty. Yes, it makes this less salty, and this is this one less um, like unsalty. Taste this. <laughs> That's his now. That's our knife. <laughs> Wait, she doesn't like being held like that, like that, yeah. She's so perfect, like perfectly perfect black cat with greenish eyes. Like all in oil green. Can I say rascal, Lily? Yeah. Yeah, she's such a rascal. She's one of a it's kind. <laughs> Look, she's gonna jump back. I like snooping a lot. What's mm -hmm. this one? Both of them jump and they they fight so hard. I'll link Lilith's uh, channel in the description. And Follow her and see more of life of cats. <laughs> life of cats. Life of cats. You see this? Hmm. She's probably smelling the fish I ate. It's such a terrible smell. <laughs> Can you imagine? <laughs> She's gonna eat me. Mm -hmm. She's such a hunter. <laughs> well, you can go now. <coughs> you can go. Miss Gishesh. Uh, she doesn't care. Cats are careless. Cats are cats. <laughs> yeah, they're careless, but they're so cute. They give you so much joy. Peace. Let him eat finish, Anushas. No, he's done eating. He's done eating? Uh, excuse me, Miss Cat, uh, I have to work. People are waiting for my opinion on certain food. That's like No, don't hold it like that. That's why he doesn't like you. I mean, he loves you, but don't, don't, don't hold it like that. <laughs> Okay, you don't have to hold him. He's a big cat. Look at this. I think you should See, she's ready to attack him anytime. Like she's a ready, she's a born attacker. Look. You can attack him. <laughs> the fight is about to start. She's ready. She's ready. She's getting her claws ready. Nice and clean. Mm -hmm. That's her attack. He's sneezing. He's sneezing. He's sneezing so far. She's washing her hands. And that's Let's another see. attack. Sneezing. <laughs> that's a virus attack. He's sneezing at her. <laughs> Look at them, we're so synchronizing. Oh, I wish you saw it. They both were washing their hands. Paws, I mean. 
Oh my god, so cute. <laughs> Too cute. Okay, you can um, do your thing and we'll go do our thing. Okay, I want you to try. Um, I'm sorry, but my husband, if he doesn't try whatever I try and think it's good, we're gonna have a big fight. You can hear how he's <laughs> enjoying chewing his food. It's so good. Oh, we're gonna, it's good, huh? You didn't like this one. You liked oh, artichoke number three in your list. Number two and number one. As a taste wise. Chad? They're both the same. No, this is not the same. This is so salty and grainy. I mean, it, it's up to a taste. Lily like like that. Yours is better. Mine is better. See, he knows if he doesn't say yours is better, we're gonna fight. <laughs> I'm joking. We never fight. We just beat each other <laughs> slowly. <laughs> Big, don't hold him like that, guys. I don't know how to hold cats. Yeah, you need to learn how to hold cats. Uh, go search on YouTube how to hold cats tutorial. There should be how to hold cats. They've been watching cat tutorials, not tutorials, information, learning about cats, what this thing means. Anyway, they have really good idea about cats. This one I never purchased. Wild tuna in Al albacore wild tuna in olive oil. Oops. I didn't know this comes. Oh, it's easy to open. I like when it's this easy. <clears throat> and very it splashy. It's tuna in olive oil. Mm. You're not trying it. I need to wipe it because there was an oil splash. Olive oil splash. Mm -hmm. And it got kind of all over the place. You want to try some albacore wild tuna in olive oil? Mm, no. no? Yeah? No. Why not? You want to try some chocolate spread? Mm, yeah. No. You try tuna, you try chocolate. Mm. Yeah, you can never convince them. I'm going to take it out from the jar. Let's see if this will come out from the jar. I, I just want to show you how it looks. Big, you know, if you try tuna, you'll get so strong and play even better hockey. You know, it helps uh, build muscles. Right? Right, right. Huh? You don't want to play better hockey? Huh? I can't hear you. Come. Instead of eating tuna, he can just practice like this. But this will help you practice better, Beck. It's actually good. It's a bit dry, but probably this needs to be mixed with something. Taste-wise, it's delicious. Texture-wise, it's super dry. Maybe if it's mixed with kind of... Um, with this oil or I don't want to say mayo I don't enjoy mayo although tuna sandwich is made with mayo but this will make a really good sandwich so tiny a small jar Let's see. better and better it's delicious it doesn't need anything else no mayo no pickles no olives I don't try it so good. Lee, would you like to try some tuna? Uh, sure. Come. Will it be better at playing hockey and stronger? Uh, yeah, you'll be better at hockey. And you can even have built more muscles. Even without bread, it's delicious. Mm -hmm. Lee, let's try without bread. Yeah. 
when she turned um, non-vegan, non-vegetarian, she was hard to um, um, accepting fish taste. Mm -hmm. She was kind of suffering. It tasted gross, honestly. But this is like now I'm eating more and more of the fish and stuff, and I'm not. I'm used to it now. That's what people told me. Mm -hmm. They said uh, make her trying uh, more and more. Eventually, she'll gain the taste uh, liking back, and she does. She ate raw tuna, tuna tartar, oysters and all of a sudden on her birthday she was going wild. I know, it was really good. She's Pisces <laughs> and she likes fish. I just don't like oysters though. I still don't like those. You don't like oysters? Don't say it, Lily. Really. I mean, I didn't like the ones I had. We can have them. No, we don't. No, oysters were amazing. I didn't like them. I thought you loved them. No? No. I just wanted yeah. to try it so I could like Open up my taste buds because I was really See, trying oysters to. Oysters opens her taste bud and she's ungrateful to the oysters. She doesn't like them. I'm grateful but to you. You're it. the one who made me eat all the fish. Well, I'm not the one me. who made you. Made me the fish. <laughs> I, I made myself eat all the fish. I remember. Yeah, she wasn't trying. I mean, she was trying to kind of accept the taste. She would eat steak and all the other um, poultry. How you relate to? But not fish. No, I know. I ask her try. I know she will like it. Did you like it? Mm. 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 See, she's a baby David. Mm. Yum, yum. You want some bread? <laughs> choo, choo. I miss the tuna sandwiches though. See how I have them. Mm -hmm. But it will make like tiny one sandwich, half sandwich. Like tiny. Five sandwiches. Five sandwiches. Five sandwiches. Anyway, but it's good. It's mm -hmm. delicious. I'm not asking Lucy to try. She'll run away. Lucy, would you like to try some tuna? Are you running away? Good. <laughs> she would never try. I mean, I'm scared to ask. She won't forgive me. Okay, what else? And last but not least, <laughs> oils. I think two jars of oils in this big package. Because uh, this is not just oils, it's some other stuff with oil. It's a gift basket um, and the price is better rather than buying separately. You buy it with a gift basket. Let's see how we open this thing. Okay, this is not edible. As far as I know. I tried, it tasted terrible. Hmm, ah, okay, I knew it. Two bottles of olive oil. Look. Um, this one is more fruity flavor as far as I remember. Yes, and this one is non-fruity. We'll try that. I mean, let's try it. Oh, we have, oh, I didn't know about this one. Balsamic vinegar. As far as I remember, I already purchased this one, I think. I purchased the same package, although I see something new. Yes, I have this, so I'm not gonna open this one. Um, I'll show you the one that I opened. And maybe we'll give this to someone, maybe, to someone who deserves it. Hmm, I'll think. I'll keep it. I'm joking. This one, um, it was good, but not as good as the ones we buy from um, Ohai Olive Oil Company. They have this variety of different, amazingly delicious um, balsamic vinegars. Oh, this is another good company. This is, we got it from Santa Barbara. Really, really delicious. Viva Oliva. One better than the other. So delicious. And the one from Ohio. Look. Very good. They are amazing. They are the best. And you love to enjoy it with freshly baked uh, bread. Mm -hmm. Sourdough. Oops. This is the one from Carly. We haven't used it much. Okay. We should recall the taste. You want to try some balsamic olive uh, with 
Pasionic Finikers of Modena. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Mm, he's thinking. So I, I guess I'm not gonna gift it to him. Let me grab something. I love olive oil in general and it has to be really fine, good quality or else. Or else I can't simply eat it with bread because olive oil is just olive oil. You don't need too many things with olive oil. Some good bread um, and wine goes very well. Sometimes olive oil, bread and wine and nothing else needed. This one is more liquidy. The ones we buy are thicker. Uh, those are like sauces. Anyway, let's try it. The fruity one. I, to be honest, I didn't feel too much difference, like a significant difference. No, my husband has to try it or else. It's good. Mm -hmm. It's delicious. And I also purchased, I don't know if it's here, but they had this um, salt, olive oil and rosemary spice. We would simply grind it and it's amazing. It was delicious. It's somewhere over there. Hold on. Yes, this is like coarse Italian salt with olive and rosemary. It's really delicious. Um, but we're gonna try it without. Let's see, I wanna feel the difference, big difference. Mm, I love this one so much more than this one. Aram, you try it. This is even deeper and more bitter. I love the bitterness. Although many complain, you can't... Um, I mean, they don't like the bitterness of olive oil, but if it's not bitter, it means it's not freshly, coldly, virginly squeezed. It's delicious. Mm. Mm? I saw him moving his head, like, vigorously. <laughs> mm, so delicious. I'm just gonna give it a quick dip. Mm. This is so tangy. It's good, but probably this will go very well with salads only. The ones we buy from Ohio. And we have only two bottles. I just want to show you the consistency. Honey ginger is liquidy too. These are thicker, more on a sweet side. So delicious. Hold on, I'm gonna check something. We normally have like at least five bottles. Oh, this is amazing. Cinnamon pear. Let me show you the consistency. As far as I know, you can reduce balsamic vinegar and turn it into like more of a um, thick sauce consistency this is absolutely delicious with olive oil two dips why not mm. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. would you like to try some peach uh, balsamic sauce is it peach no and it's aged for 18 years cinnamon pear absolutely delicious you want to try some? It makes you like strong and muscleless. Yeah? Okay. Hmm, you used to be muscleless. We found out. Your opinion, Mr. Beck? Excuse me, Mr. Beck. You want your opinion? Actually, not that bad, but it kind of hurts my throat. It, uh, not bad, no, hurts his throat. Your throat? Yeah. Because mm. it goes more spicy here to my throat. It's not spicy, I'm Maybe you have a very special throat bag. Yep. It's good. Mm, so delicious. Everything is delicious. 
I'm done tasting. I think this is pasta. Let's see. Such a nice packaging for simple pasta, but it's not simple, to be honest. We purchased and I cooked it. I made a pasta a la vodka, then a la vodka. It was absolutely delicious, one of a kind. It didn't taste like any other uh, penne. It's delicious. The quality is... The quality does matter. Okay, I'll put it like this. It will look even more nicer. And we got a couple of... Um, oh, there Arabiata is really good. This is the secret ingredient when I marinate my chicken for barbecue. I mean, this is what makes it, I don't know how it tastes, but every time I add this specific thing, and it's just walnuts, garlic, olive oil, and probably salt, and only a tablespoon or so to entire, let's say, two, three pounds of chicken. I don't know how it manages to turn that meat into something magical well when you eat that barbecue you kind of have special powers you can even fly if you want oh this pesto is arnak's favorite basil pesto it's so delicious Lee, would you like to try some pesto yes i have a special way of asking if she wants to try something oh, this pesto. one okay you love it you open it okay, where is it? mr pesto And what's this one? Basil tomato pasta sauce. Oh yeah, I made it. Remember I made pasta with just this and the sauce. Mm. So delicious. Okay, let's scrub all the stuff uh, with bread. We eat everything and anything with bread only or else. I love the pasta one. I know, it's so delicious. I'll be making the sourdough bread pretty soon, so stay tuned on that. Wait, I dropped some. Mm -hmm. It's great. It's delicious, and it's good with uh, just with bread. You don't have to make pasta. I used to put it in salads too. Mm -hmm. You would make what kind of salad? Arugula and stuff. Arugula, like with carrots and. Stuff I was saute them. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. No, I'll right. This on top. It was so good. It's so salty. I love it. She started to like salty. Her taste buds changed. And also, one thing uh, that I'm I'm thinking, and someone also commented that she was she used to be allergic to cats. That's why we really wanted to get them. Everyone wanted except me. Mm. <laughs> and also the main reason, one of the main reasons, she was allergic. But then still I decided to get it. I wanted to be I wanted them to be happy. Mom of the year, right? <laughs> she is. And and she's not allergic. I know. See magic happened. She changed her taste buds, her um, diet, can I say? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Lifestyle? Lifestyle. It was a lifestyle. Seven years. Seven years, yeah. Seven years. And she started becoming allergic to zucchini. And now she's becoming a bit more normal. She's not allergic to certain things. And even your allergies kind of calm down. Did you notice? I have no allergies after allergy season. Like this March, April, May. Mm -hmm. So far, I haven't had allergies. You need to knock on. I do <laughs> Yeah, okay, let's try this uh, whatever sauce, arabiata or is it arabiata? No, basil tomato. Are you ready, Lily, for this challenge, basil tomato, mm -hmm. uh, whatever sauce? It's very liquidy and so rich. You want me to feed you, Lily? <laughs> That's choo, okay, choo. I, got it. I got the crust. She's a big girl now. Although I never had problems with her eating or tasting. No, I've never had a problem with eating. She's the most <laughs> normal of my all of my five children. I mean, she eats normal, like a normal person. Vegetables, 
like mixed food jashes. Mm. None of them does. Simple. Anyway, we don't want to talk about problematic. <laughs> It smells okay, it just tastes like mayonnaise. Yeah, it tastes uh, normal. It's very greasy, mm -hmm. very olive oily. But as far as I remember, it's been a while since we tried arrabbiata. Here you go. Here we go. See, she's such a polite, she has manners. Mm -hmm. It's like the spicy version of this. Mm, this is, no, it's a bit on the peppery side, mm. more peppery taste. This is delicious. Yeah, it's good. It's a bit spicy, maybe for you it's spicy. No, it's not it's spicy. You're not a baby anymore? <laughs> no, I still don't like spicy. <laughs> yeah, she's a baby. She doesn't like spicy. I mean, she can't eat spicy for some reason. I just don't like it. That's why you're a baby. That's what I'm saying. Babies don't like spicy. They can't eat spicy. Comment down below if I'm a baby or not, please. I'm reading their comments in my mind. Yes, she is one of a kind baby. <laughs> okay, I'm just showing you the consistency and the texture of this walnut pesto or sauce. For some reason, I can't eat it like this. Can you? I think when we had it one time, I think I didn't like it that much, but okay, let's try it again. I'm gonna try it. <laughs> sure. Like a cup, a cup a cut it, a drop. This is from that. Um, this is chicken marinade. Um, That's okay. Yeah, this is from this set, the gift box. The party set? Party set. It's okay, I don't really. I'd rather eat this one. <laughs> mm -hmm. It doesn't have any like outstanding it has to be flavor. Mixed with something. Not pasta. Mm. With what? Maybe a salad, like Probably in a dressing, salad. like a teaspoonful to make it like thick or something. Mm -hmm. No, I bought it for my chicken barbecue. It's like my ingredients. Now you can make it yourself. Simple, good quality uh, walnuts, olive oil, good quality probably one to one or I don't know, depending how thick or liquidy you want. A garlic, salt, pepper. Mix it, blend it. It's ready. Yeah. I think that's it. No more. No more nothing. <laughs> no more nothing. <laughs> Nothing's left as far as I know. I, I can't remember what I ordered. Apparently I ordered something from Sur La Table. I was doing like what I bought from this store. And I had this feeling that something is missing. Something is missing. And yesterday Lil, I got a email notification that the plate that I purchased uh, was out of stock so they refunded me but how come I didn't even remember that that plate is missing from my entire order and I didn't even order too many things anyway I think whatever I ordered they delivered it as far as I remember yeah most importantly we got the chocolate spread we got um, our olive oil the rest is a bonus Thank you so much for watching. Thank you, Lil, for uh, test tasting or taste testing. Taste testing. Taste testing with me, helping me. I love you. I, I will too. always love you. <laughs> True. Mother's love is in, in, infinite. Yeah. Endless. And forever. Mm -hmm. Forever. Yeah. Forever. <laughs> I'll tell you the same thing. Yes. She said whatever she said. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Please uh, subscribe to Lilith's channel if you want to see her um, colorful, happy, bright and joyful life moments. And yeah, thank you so much for uh, watching. I'll see you soon. Thank you Lilith for watching. Are you subscribed to my channel? Really? Yeah? Yeah? I'm gonna check. <laughs> I doubt she said <laughs> I am. I doubt my kids subscribe. <laughs> no, Ar Arnap likes all of our videos, you know? He does? Yeah, from his channel. He has a channel? Well, I mean, like, you know how people have their own Oh, channel. okay. He always likes our videos. I was gonna link his channel link in the description, but... <laughs> no, not like that. He just has one. Uh, account. They yeah, account. Channel. They call it channel. Okay. <laughs> so, yeah. No need to subscribe to our Arnap's account. It's 
it has nothing in it. <laughs> He's just using it to <laughs> like watch our videos. It has nothing in it. It has nothing. <laughs> yes, thank you. Let's have it. Okay. Okay. You see? Come. We're done filming. She knows you're speaking English. She's not gonna. <laughs> <laughs> What's not happening on camera? <laughs> <laughs> It's okay.